In the last video, we demonstrated Add to Cart feature using providers. You can find link in description of all previous videos of Flutter WooCommerce series. Once the customer has decided which all products to order, we need to provide a checkout page where customers can enter his order related details like address, phone number and email. To implement this feature, we are using Flutter Forms. Flutter Forms are completely different from whatever we have done till now because it involves POST request rather than GET request. And we need to validate user's input. So let's check out how our app is working now. So first we have to go to the home page and here we can see the listing of categories. And if we click on any category, we get to see the respective products of that category. And we can go ahead and do the add to cart. So add to cart is also working perfectly. And now we can click on cart and go to the cart page. Here we can see the total is getting calculated. And this till this part, it was done in the video we did before this and now we when we click on the pay button we navigate to the checkout page now here we have used the form to fill out the details for the order so let's go ahead and fill up the form And here is the country drop down for now I have just kept two uh, countries and you can see that these countries are fully functional like when we select a country the respective states get selected and state also has the feature of search. So if I put California then only the California is listed. So we can go ahead and select India. And here also the states of India are there. I've just kept three states for the testing purpose. And now when I click on a state, it gets selected. Now let's fill up the address. And now if we click on submit, we get order successful, we get the order number and we get the order total. So now if we go to the backend part, uh, that is the admin panel and refresh, then we get this order and uh, yeah, the product that we added uh, is showing here so it's working pretty much and uh, now next yeah so one thing is here that order total is not correctly showing uh, maybe because here we are adding a shipping fee of rupees 10 and uh, the taxes so maybe that is the one difference and i think that can be easily added to the code uh, that is not much of an issue so if we 998 if we add 10 plus 1.80 i think the total we go to this amount only so yeah so i i think the checkout is working pretty well the next thing that we can do is integration of the payment gateway i have already added a button now let's once have a look of the code 
so the main action is happening in the checkout screen this is the checkout screen that we have designed and here only we have used the form and uh, this is the form that's being used it's a medium size form and uh, to use this and uh, we have also added the validations to this form if all most of the fields are made required and uh, the the forms value are being captured here you can see using a on text field saved button and once we capture this we create uh, we uh, convert it into a json data and we make a post request on the server and that we are doing in the order model as you can see we are doing this and for this we have made uh, different models the order model is here and then there is a address model that is also being used in the order model and uh, yeah that's pretty much it and the data that we are creating we are sending to the server using a post request and once we get the response we are passing the response and uh, getting the order number from there that we are sending on the payment screen and in the payment screen we are showing the order number with the success message so that's pretty much what's happening in the code and code is uh, done very neatly so you can go for the code and you can modify it and use it as per your requirement if you have a woocommerce website or if your client or customer has a woocommerce website you can easily convert their website into a mobile application which will be based on flutter thank you so much for watching the video in the next video we will be doing the payment part